Hi, I'm Ricky Green, 11-time NFR qualifier, winner of the 1980 NFR average, and the winner of the 1984 BFI, and this is a 1962 Cadillac. In a matter of minutes, you'll discover why this car holds a secret to you catching consistently, roping faster, and winning more often. It's the same secret that enabled me to win the 1988 NFR average, win the 1984 BFI, and set arena records across the country. Go on to teach over a thousand clinics and make millions of dollars in the process. More importantly though, without this car, I never would have discovered how to see in slow motion, which has been the real secret to my success and the success of thousands of my students like Twister, Brett, and Court Smith, who recently won 250000 in Las Vegas at the World Series Finals, or Kevin Schreiner who won three Dodge pickups as a 16-year-old. Curious? I'm sure. It will all make perfect sense to you in just a few minutes. Watch this presentation until the end and you'll discover exactly what slow motion is and how it's the secret to being in sync with your horse, roping faster, and controlling your nerves in high pressure situations. If you're a header, you'll discover how slow motion roping is the key to scoring well, catching consistently, and handling cattle correctly to give your healer an easy shot. If you're a healer, You'll discover how slow motion roping is the key to getting in good position, timing, and delivering your loop. So you're consistently catching two feet and putting money in your pocket. I'll also share with you the single biggest mistake team ropers make, causing them to plateau for years, and in some cases causing them to completely lose their passion for roping and quit. I don't know how much longer I'll have this presentation online for free, so watch it right now while you still can. Before I get into it though, let me say this. You may think you've tried it all or seen it all when it comes to learning how to improve your roping. Yet I can guarantee that you've never seen anything like what I'm about to reveal to you today. In fact, the last tip I'll share today near the end is the most powerful of them all. Something I've only ever shared with some very special people. But it'll only make sense if you understand the first two tips I'll share with you in just a moment. So keep watching. And the quick tips I'll be giving you today will get you started to see runs in slow motion. Not only renew your hope, but completely change the way you look at roping forever. Remember this presentation is currently free, but the tips I'm about to give you are so valuable that I may end up charging for them. And they will empower you to achieve your roping goals faster and with greater ease. However, I want to first share a somewhat painful story with you from my early days about how I overcame self-doubt and got on the path towards discovering slow motion roping and becoming an NFR champion. You'll see why this is all so important to your roping success in just a few minutes. Deal? A lot of folks think I was always a great roper who could quickly and consistently catch practically every steer, while in fact I was the exact opposite. You see, in my younger days, I would rope two or three in a row and then miss the high team steer when the money was up. Thinking back, it was 1973, four years before my first national finals. It was a cold, foggy evening, and we were in winter overalls. I was out of Sears, California at Don Gates Arena with my horse, Cowboy. And as usual, at that time in my life, I was feeling okay until all of a sudden I was up and the high team steer left the box. I was nervous, feeling the pressure and doubting myself. I just wanted to rope my best and make some money, something I bet you want too. My partner Randy scored well, caught the steer around both horns and turned him. It happened so fast and despite my nerves and the pressure, I managed to get in good position. I was watching the hind legs, trying to fight off my doubt and get in time, and then as usual, I swatted him. Let me tell you, I felt disappointed and disheartened. A part of me couldn't believe it because Randy gave me such a good look. But another part of me was thinking, believe it, you suck. Because that's what my cousin Eddie, who was a header, used to say to me when I missed one when we were kids. I remember driving 99 feeling down on myself in my 1962 Cadillac with Cowboy in the homemade trailer I was pulling. I stopped at 7-Eleven, got some sugar cubes, and gave them the Cowboys a treat because he worked so well. I drove through the fog in the San Joaquin Valley and had a thought that changed my life forever. What if I didn't know the word doubt? Then I could be confident and wrote my best. 
I rolled down the window, enjoyed the cool breeze. I threw doubt out the window. I told myself, you are great. Everyone knows you're great. You're going to be a famous healer. Rather than dwelling on the fact that I missed the high team steer earlier that day, I chose to believe that I needed that to happen to really push me over the edge, finally throw away all my doubt, and make me focus even more than ever so I can go to the next level and fulfill my dreams of becoming a famous healer. And this is what set me on the path towards learning how to see in slow motion, which I'll tell you about in just a moment. When I got back home, I practiced more than ever. I became more aware of how much my focus mattered to the clarity of my shots. It was not a matter of trying harder, but a matter of seeing clearer. Let me say that again. It's not a matter of trying harder, but a matter of seeing clearer. I remember one time at the NFR in Las Vegas, Nevada. Alan Bach was the team in front of me. He rode out of the healing box, rode over to me and calmly said, I know where there's a great ice cream bar nearby. It's got everything. Fruit whip, all kinds of toppings. Let's go there after we rope our steers. Minutes later, he rode back in the box and set the arena record. That's the level of relaxation slow motion roping gives you, which I'll get into in a moment. But first, let me tell you about the moment I experienced it for the first time. I was in my third year of rodeo, and although I no longer doubted myself, I still got nervous and felt pressure from time to time. But I started doing something I, I recommend you to do. I started talking to myself as if I was two people. The great athlete roper Ricky, and then the Ricky that got nervous, hoped he could do good for his partner, and needed the money to buy a new trailer. You see, the great athlete roper Ricky is super talented, feels no pressure, and always performs perfectly because he just roped for the love of the game. So the roper Ricky started telling the other Ricky, sit back and watch. Shut up. Don't talk. Don't tell me what to do because you're not a roper. I'm the roper. You can sign autographs and focus on the money when I'm done. But for right now, shut up because you're just a thinker and you're not a roper. So I learned to just ride in the box, look at the legs, and let roper Ricky do his magic. This works really well. You've got to learn to get out of your own way. This was the start of how I learned to see in slow motion. But when it really happened for the first time was when I was at Santa Maria, California at a three-head rodeo along the coast, and I was fast team back. As Roper Ricky, I told other Ricky, sit back, relax, and watch me win the rodeo. I got to thinking, I'm going to enjoy this. I'm going to get really focused and just let Roper Ricky do his magic. And that's when it happened. As I was watching the steer hop around the corner, all of a sudden, the hops of the steer were in slow motion. I could see every detail. I could even see particles of dirt flying up in the air as the feet hit the ground. I could see it all in the slow motion. Moments later, I healed the steer and everything came back to normal. In the weeks and months after this surreal experience, I ended up formulating a step-by-step -step system for seeing in slow motion that I've followed and thousands of my students have followed and that can create massive improvement in your team roping, whether you're a header or you're a healer. And today I'm going to share it with you and save you the hassles of years of effort it took me to hone this system into perfection. So keep watching. And keep in mind that even though I've had a great roping career and been very successful helping folks like you improve your roping, I'm really no different than you or any other roper that simply has a passion for the sport. I just happened to figure out a really simple step-by-step -step system for the average person like you and me to see in slow motion and be the best roper you can be. Like I said earlier, this is a system that allows people just like us, real everyday men and women, to become better horsemen, rope faster, catch more consistently, and thrive under pressure. Not only that, if you're a header, It'll help you stop breaking the barrier, stop splitting your horns, and stop giving poor handles for the healers. If you're a healer, it would help you ride a smooth corner, get in position, improve your timing and delivery. So you're consistently roping two feet, making it to the pay window. Yes, that's what slow motion roping can do for you, plus so much more. Now I'll be covering all the details of it with you in just a moment. However, first I must warn you about the real problem you face today. 
This is the invisible villain behind why you aren't winning more often and is keeping you from achieving success. The sad fact is, you've been unknowingly lied to for years when it comes to taking your rope to the next level. And these lies are the reason you've plateaued now and in the past. These lies are also responsible for why you can rope well in the practice bin, then fall apart at the jackpots. Here's one of the lies that you may actually believe that angers me the most. When you rope well and say, I hope they don't raise my number. What a load of nonsense. Please, if you have ever believed this, stop right now. I'll explain why in a moment. Just know this. Countless other smart ropers have fallen victim to this rather clever lie. Yet you have to lay it aside right now. Because if you don't, you'll never get better. Because subconsciously, you're telling yourself, I hope I don't get better. You'll end up roping just as well as you always have. In fact, you may even get worse. Listen, this is not what I want for you. I know it's not what you desire for yourself, right? So let's keep watching. Chances are you heard some inconsistent ropers say that nonsense at one of your first few ropings and soon discovered why they think that way. They want to keep their number low because they think it'll give them a better chance of winning. Which just is not true, which I'll explain in just a moment. But for now, just realize this. Your roping struggles and challenges are directly due to this type of thinking. It's not your fault. If you really feel a need to lay blame, don't lay it on yourself. Blame the person you heard say they hope their number doesn't get raised. And everyone you've heard say it since. By roping against you rather than hiring number ropers, they're trying to rob you from winning and they're bringing you down by their lack of desire to grow. However, it's now your responsibility to know better and do all you can to go to the next level. Fair? The truth is that you should want your number to get raised. The better you get, the better partners you'll get and the more you'll win. I didn't become an 11 time NFR qualifier and winner of the 1988 NFR average roping with threes or fours or fives. And you won't reach your full potential as a team roper if you don't want your number to get raised when you're improving. Now that you're aware of the lies and how they've crippled your roping consistency for years, let's dive into the three tips I have for you today. These are the exact same tips and tactics that countless thousands of ropers have used to see in slow motion and have massive success with their roping, the success you desire and deserve. And by far the most important tip is my third and final tip about how you actually see in slow motion. But it'll only make sense if you fully understand my first two tips that are essential parts of the slow motion roping system. To begin, avoid at all costs prejudging what the roping is going to be like. Some people believe having a concrete game plan for their runs is actually a good thing. However, this isn't true. It's good to have an overall flexible game plan, but if you can't adapt your plan to your specific steer and run, you'll struggle with consistency. If you're a header, you might score poorly, wave it off, or mess up your handle. And if you're a healer, you might struggle with positioning, timing, and delivery. Here's what you need to do. At your next roping, go over and watch a few teams run. See what the steers are actually like. See how hard or slow they're starting. Are they hanging back on the rope? Are they running up the rope? Analyze a few runs, then decide on a flexible game plan with your partner. Once you learn how to see in slow motion, this will still be important, but not as crucial because you'll be more equipped to rope different types of steers. Trust me, just implementing this one tip will make you more prepared and confident when you're in a box preparing to make a run. Just picture it. Even when your run isn't set up perfect, if you're a header and the steer ducks his head, or you get a late start and need to reach, you adapt your game plan. Make a good clean catch and shock everyone watching with how flexible you are. If you're a healer and your header doesn't give you the best look, you still manage to get in time, deliver your loop, and rope two feet. All because of the flexible game plan you and your partner created when you watched a couple of runs earlier on. And when you add the rest of the slow motion roping system to your game plan, in just a moment, You'll be shocked at how easily you'll be able to handle different types of steers. Now before I jump into my second tip, let me ask you a question. How would you like to actually enjoy roping again? 
like you did before you started getting nervous and putting pressure on yourself to catch or win by discovering how to actually enjoy roping when your money is up. Do you think you'll actually rope better? Of course you will. Think about it. A school student who actually enjoys the opportunity to take SATs and showcase how hard they studied will do better than a student who's nervous and thinking about what will happen if they don't get into the college they want. Same goes for roping. That's why you need to do what I mentioned earlier. Start talking to yourself as two people and come up with a nickname and identity for your roping persona. I'm Roper Ricky. I'm super talented. Never feel pressure and I always rope my best. The other Ricky focuses on not missing rather than winning. He focuses on the money rather than the love of the game. So when I'm in the box ready to go, I remind myself of who I am, the great athlete Roper Ricky, who loves and enjoys the sport more than anything. Thinking like this, not worrying about the money and showing up as the Roper in you who loves to rope allows you to compete at your best. Because you're just enjoying yourself and having fun in the practice pen, do the same at the next roping and watch what happens. And trust me, roping is about to become a lot more enjoyable for you when you add the slow motion roping system to your arsenal. Now I'll be sharing my most vital tip when it comes to slow motion roping and becoming the best roper you can be. This is my power tip. The one that you have to do no matter what or else. The other tips I just gave you are pretty much useless. This is the tip that will allow you to actually see in slow motion. It's the secret to my success in the NFR that gave me an unfair advantage over other ropers. It's how thousands of students have experienced massive results and collectively made millions of dollars. And soon, I'll bet it'll be the system that unlocks your ability. See in slow motion, catch more consistently, rope faster, and win more often. As you know already, it's what I call slow motion roping. And here's how it works. If you're a header, I'll explain slow motion roping for headers in a moment, but let me start with healing. If you want to slow the run down, watch the stride of the steer. A steer running has a stride from six to nine feet. So even as the steer runs by, you look at the steer as he pushes off and lands, counting a smooth, calm tone. One, two, three, four. You see what I mean? Look at the steer's hind feet and count the hops or strides of the steer. This will really slow the run down as you start to count as the feet hit the ground. Every time the feet hit the ground, in front of you count. A lot of people try to see the legs just when they are back. So as they try to deliver, the legs are going forward and they miss. Most people try to time in half hops so things are too fast. It's like they say now to themselves every time the legs are back. They deliver the rope while the legs are going forward and they wonder why they miss. But if you watch the total jump, from forward to back and then to forward again. It gives you more of a slow motion vision. Tell yourself now when the legs are forward. So when you say now, you start your delivery and the legs will be coming back, opening up for the loop to go under the steer. Pretty cool, right? Now that's just the beginning. And I actually have a DVD called Slow Motion Rope and it goes into much more detail. I'll tell you about that in just a moment, but now let me tell you about how slow motion roping applies to headers. It also helps to see in strides because you can look in the chute at the steer's head and watch how he gathers up and pushes off to leave the box. And as you learn how to read a steer's stride, you can anticipate and judge how fast the steer is striding out of the box. The steer's first two strides are three feet long, and a third stride is six feet long. And then if he's a runner, he can stride up to nine feet. One time at Rodeo in Norco, California, I was heading, and I told D. Pickett, team rope world champion, all-around world champion, it seems like I'm blacking out leaving the box. I can see the steer in the box, and it seems like I don't see him again until I'm three strides in the arena. D. told me I was jerking my head up after my start, and my eyes had to search the arena again to find the steer's horns. This was causing me to lose focus and get behind in the run. On the first year, I had ended up straight behind the steer and didn't even know I'd gotten there. He told me to look through the bars in the chute at the steer's head and keep my eyes on the horns the whole time and make sure I don't jerk my head up after I scored. So the second steer at Norco, I kept my eyes on the steer's horns in the chute as he exited the chute and ran into the arena. It was so easy to be ready to rope because I knew where my target was. 
I could stay wide and read my shot coming up. That was the first time as a header that I saw my run in slow motion. As you stand at the box, watching the score, look at the steer strides leaving the box. Count the strides while maintaining focus on his head. It'll drop when he gets ready to leave, and then his shoulders will rise as he pushes off. You can clearly see the steer's head rise and fall and count strides by focusing on the subtle movements of its head. If you watch a three or four second run, notice that the loop is going on the steer the second, third, or fourth stride. So look how easy it is for you to see if you count the strides it takes to rope the steer in four. You could count one, two, three, four, and it wouldn't seem that fast. This is the foundation of my slow motion roping system. It has the power to give you a lifetime of roping success like it did for me. Imagine this. You will forever leave behind the frustrations you've no doubt experienced when it comes to roping consistently. All those frustrations end today. Not only that, you will also redefine who you are as a roper. Maybe you're Speedy Sam or Consistent Kelly. you remember what it's like to actually enjoy roping. On top of that, though, you'll experience roping like never before because you have a system. The hidden secret behind my successful roping career and the success of some of my students who are out winning big money. And now you have access to this starting today. I think you'll agree that I've covered some really valuable tips with you today. And I feel you may be a bit overwhelmed with it all, which is totally understandable. Basically, this means you have only two choices on where to go from here. Choice one, you can take all the tips and info I just gave you and try to put the puzzle pieces together on your own without any guidance. And you never know, you may be able to put the puzzle pieces together eventually on your own. It will take a little longer and there's no guarantee you'll make it, but it's possible. Or there's a smarter choice, the 1,000 smart ropers take to go to the next level. This is the fastest, smartest way possible to improve your rope and consistency without all the confusion. Why go at this alone when I've already done all the work for you? I've had decades of experience and condensed everything into a system with folks like you in mind. It's a system that I've perfected and tested in over 1,000 clinics with over 10,000 ropers just like you, and it works virtually every single time. Introducing the Slow Motion Roping Video DVD which reveals my full system to catching consistently, roping faster, and winning more often. This radically simple yet effective slow motion roping system will work for you even if you're just a beginner. You don't have enough time to practice, you're recovering from injury, or you're in your late 50s, 60s, or 70s and haven't roped for 40 years. Even if you feel as if you've tried absolutely everything, before I tell you more about the DVD and the special offer I have for you today, let me tell you what the DVD is not, so there's no false expectations. The entire slow motion roping system is not some super fancy hard thing to implement into your roping toolkit. Don't you think you've been lied to enough by amateur ropers who don't even want to improve? Isn't it time you start using what's proven to work? What makes the entire slow motion roping system truly unique and so powerful is the fact that I've refined it after running more roping clinics than any human being ever lived. That proud fat couple with over a decade of NFR experience has allowed me to identify patterns among NFR champions and my successful students that I truly believe no one in the world could possibly discover other than me. And starting right now, you can get access to my life's work, all my secrets, and join the thousands of ropers out actually enjoying their roping and making money because of what my system unlocked inside of them. The success patterns I've discovered and condensed into the slow motion roping system finally give you the freedom to keep your horse calm, experience roping speed like never before, and having rock solid mental game when your money is up. If you're a header, you'll finally stop breaking the barrier, waving it off, and letting down your healer with poor handles. If you're a healer, get excited to consistently be in good position, timing, and delivering your loop perfectly, consistently catching two feet, and becoming the healer that all the headers want to rope with. Now before I reveal the current discounted price of the DVD or special bonuses you will get if you order today, I need to be 100% honest with you. If you're not committed to being the best roper you can be, and you would rather remain a low number roper than you actually are, 
ruining our sport for everyone else who's trying their best. If that's you, I'm trusting it's not, then you need to leave this website right now because the special offer I'm making today is only for what I call power team ropers. Ropers who do all they can to become the powerful, best ropers they can be. What I've done is make the slow motion roping system as easy as humanly possible to implement. So while becoming a great roper isn't easy, nothing worthwhile is. The offer I'm about to reveal makes it as easy and affordable as possible. I've recently caught up with Lacey Madalena from Roping.com and shared the system with her. And here's what she had to say. After learning the slow motion roping system from Ricky and watching his DVD, I can confidently say it's truly revolutionary stuff that's made me much more consistent and has completely changed the way I approach my roping. She's just one of the thousands of ropers that have already had the opportunity to put the system to work. And by the way, you may have already heard ropers talk about the slow motion roping. But if you haven't, it's probably because those who know about it are keeping it close to their chest with all the extra money they're winning. Because if it got leaked out to the masses, they think they'll lose their unfair advantage. The reality is, though, even if this video goes viral, most people won't watch this far. And the fact that you're still watching means that you're a power team roper already. The kind of person who's willing to do whatever it takes. And coupled with the slow motion roping system, you'll have a massive unfair advantage at your next roping. So let me tell you about the DVD. Rather than making it two or three hours, I jam-packed the gold nuggets into 35 minutes. So it's easy to get through and something you can watch over and over again to really master slow motion roping. Here's what you'll discover in the DVD. The secret to creating a power routine that brings you more focus. How to bring your A game to jackpots and watch the steers, not the ropers. The art of seeing clear. How to make timing easy and learning how to release your inner greatness. If you're looking for the easiest and fastest way to take your roping to the next level, and you're still watching this, you probably already decided that the slow motion roping system is your answer, which naturally opens the door for you to already see and feel yourself becoming a greater roper, which is amazing. Considering you've only seen the tip of the iceberg so far, Perhaps you're concerned, though, that the full slow motion roping system with all of its amazing benefits will cost you quite a bit, and in all honesty, it really should. If you think about the thousands of dollars slow motion roping is likely to put in your pocket in the next 12 months, or heck, the rest of your life, or even if you think about the fact that thousands of ropers have already paid good money to learn these secrets at my private clinics, it really should cost you quite a bit. I'll get to the price in just a moment. But first, let me remind you what you can expect. More consistency, cleaner catches, faster times, better horsemanship, stronger mental game, and much more. Now, back in 2001, I released a DVD called Knowledge and Techniques for Power Team Roping, which is the highest selling team roping DVD of all time. And we sold thousands of copies for $40 each. And to be honest, it was a great DVD. But in the last 15 or so years, I think I've come up with something that will make that DVD look quite average because I truly believe slow motion roping is revolutionary, groundbreaking. There's nothing like it. Not to toot my own horn, but I think this new DVD is at least twice as good as the Knowledge and Techniques DVD. And because you've already proven to me by watching this entire presentation that you're a power team roper, I'm going to sweeten the deal by giving you a 30-day trial of my membership website, PowerTeamRoping.com, a members-only Facebook group absolutely free. It's usually valued at 240 a year and contains over 50 plus hours of instructional roping videos from me on both heading and healing. Plus, as Power Team Rope members, at any time you can submit a video of you roping the dummy or roping the live steers, and I'll give you direct feedback at no extra charge. Now, if I was to charge $40 for the slow motion video DVD, 240 access to my membership website, and for my time to review your swing and your runs, that would bring the value of your investment today to well over $300, which is less than you would pay if you entered up a couple times at your next roping, and far less than that how much you can win from just one roping, putting the system to work. Agreed? However, just for watching this presentation today, I have a much better deal coming your way. So keep watching and get ready to act quick. 
because it's only available to the first 500 power team ropers like you, who have thrown doubt out the window, reminded themselves who's in charge, the thinker who gets nervous and focuses on the money, or the great athlete who feels no pressure, loves the sport, and does whatever it takes to improve and win. And of course, you could choose to continue down the path you're on right now and end up spending 10, 20, even 100 times more than the investment you'll make today on entry fees this year alone. If you're like most ropers who are rarely in the money or only win every now and then, or perhaps you already win quite often, but by not taking action today, you'll miss out on the big money you could be making. If you added the full slow motion roping system to your toolkit today, you can be so much more than you are. So let's just make this an easy decision for you today, okay? I feel you deserve to know why I'm offering you such a massive discount today. It's because the greatest pleasure of mine to teach tens of thousands of ropers and their children and to see our sport growing. Some of the pots are getting so lucrative these days that they can be life-changing if you win. It's all within your reach, especially if you have access to the slow-motion roping system. It's all within your ability. It's all how you see it. That's why we call it Power Team Roping. Our goal here is the same as it's always been. We create champions. And we want you to be our next success story. So I came to the decision that I need to get the slow motion roping system into the hands of as many ropers as possible. I simply cannot let price get in the way of you becoming a greater roper as well as growing the sport that I love so dearly. That means you will not be paying the retail value of 300 today. Not even close. It's not even going to be half that price. As ridiculous as it sounds, you won't even pay what I charged for my best-selling DVD in 2001. Your total investment today for the slow-motion roping system, including a 30-day trial of the Power Team Roping membership, for a limited time only, just $20. Yep, $20. Bucks. Remember, this offer is only available to the first 500 ropers to take action now. To be one of the lucky 500, look below this presentation right now. Click on the green order button that says yes, I want this amazing deal to lock in your discounted price today for 20 bucks. And remember, you get 30 days free access to my membership website, powerteamrumpin.com. If you choose that you love the 50 plus hours of instructional videos and we put on new instructional videos, having your runs reviewed and connecting with other power team ropers in our members only Facebook group, you'll be automatically billed just $20 per month after 30 days. But don't worry, you can cancel any time. I have a feeling, though, that you're going to love being a Power Team Rope member. And you're going to want to stick around for months or even years to come. If you haven't already clicked the green button below and signed up, let me say this. When you sign up today, you're taking advantage of my triple guarantee. After 30 days of putting slow motion rope into work and experiencing all the benefits you get from being a member, if you don't see a drastic improvement in your roping, or if you don't find our membership and attention to your satisfaction top notch, or even if you get sick of hearing my voice in the 50 plus hours instructional videos, no worries. I'll refund your money and you can keep the DVD. No questions asked, no hassles, no hard feelings. So look below this video right now. Click on the green button. It says, yes, I want this amazing deal to lock in your discounted price today for only 20 bucks before someone else claims it. Plus, if you act now before this presentation ends, you'll be one of the first to experience our new mobile-friendly membership website that we just launched, as well as the phone app we're releasing for our members shortly so they can access all our instructional videos with ease. Now remember, you're not just getting an incredible discount today. You're joining an exclusive group of Power Team Ropers committed to growing the sport. And a really nice perk to that is just about every member makes a lot of new roping friends and potential partners. And that can be super motivating. So for instant access to everything, including online access to the slow motion roping DVD, click on the green order button below now. Within literally a few minutes, you'll have everything at your fingertips. The entire slow motion roping system inside our secure membership website. Here's what will happen the moment you click the green button below this video. First, you'll be taken to our 100% secure checkout form, which looks like this. Start by filling out your name, email address, and phone number so we can send you your receipt and membership website access information when you're done. Then fill in the rest of your information, and after your order, 
you'll be taken to a confirmation page outlining what to do next to access your receipt and membership website access information. Is that simple? So click on the green order button now and get started.